Studios, um, where we like to try and give you the freshest content out there. Um, so today, guys, uh, as you know, this whole week we've been having a lot of technical difficulties. I restarted the computer, and you can't hear me. Oh no! Hold on a second. We're gonna get it figured out. It's always something, man. Hello. How's it going, dude? All right, can't hear me. That's a problem. Something like this. Hello. Can you hear me now? Hello. Tell me if I'm too loud. Welcome to the internet. Hello, can you hear me now? Good, good, good. Can you hear me now? <laughs> so anyway, um, turn it down a teeny bit. Thank you so much, Glad Guy. I really appreciate it. You guys have no clue. If the volume's ever off, you just tell me and I will fix it. Because that bothers me, too. Alright, we're going to be like... Boop. Sorry, guys. This mouse is not super good from long range. Probably like right there, I'd say. That's probably a good smidge. If you need more, let me know. Anyway, we do have so much to talk about Fluttershy. Oh my gosh, there's, like, Nintendo just did some crazy shit. And so, speaking of Nintendo, I figured we would take advantage of this opportunity to play a Nintendo game, which we would like to call... Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Donkey Kong 64 is not as good as I remember, guys. Um, did you see the direct? I did not get to see all of it because I was trying to work on the computer. But the parts that I did get to see were fucking phenomenal. <laughs> Nintendo has introduced us to the fucking future. What the fuck was that shit with the fucking, like, I just set it on the fucking table. And then fucking, oh, nope, we can move it over here. The two switches connect. The TV, you can play a board game. But with technology, what the fuck? Luigi Mansion 3? I didn't see that. Oh, my God. Dude, there's a lot of games I want Nintendo to do that they have not done. Yes, we know. Gamepad battery. It's fine. We don't need the gamepad. The gamepad's crap. Gosh, this is not the future, Nintendo. This this thing you made here, what you're making now, that's the future. <laughs> Thank you for being awesome. All right, back to this fucking nightmare of a game that I'll be playing for the rest of my goddamn life. All right. Back in the shit. Video output load. No, don't be like that. I think it's just the internet that's doing that. That's lame. Do you know Isabel from Animal Crossing? I don't. I don't know really any Animal Crossing stuff. Isabel is in Smash. I am in Smash right now. You're in Smash right now? Like you're playing it? That's dope, dude. Alright, fucking... What do you guys think about the all the echoes that they're making? Like that they're making like a fucking Kirby echo and like... Uh, I think it was King DDD echo. Are you guys into that? Uh, your camera is so small. So, if you guys have suggestions of how you'd like to make the stream look better, if you don't like this setup, we can do another setup or something like that. But if you want us to make the camera bigger, we can do that. We can do whatever you want. I was just trying something different because, you know. But if you guys have a preference of what looks good and what doesn't look good, let me know. We'll change it. Alright, what's up? Um, I don't fucking remember what I was doing in this stupid game. Alright, let's fucking figure this shit out. Uh, what did I see in the direct? Um, I saw the fucking board game thing. That fucking blew my mind. Um, there was a lot of stuff at the beginning that I saw. I'm trying to think. Fucking, I don't know. There was a bunch of shit, dude. So do you want a bigger camera? Because I can do that, like, right now, I think.
Get up there, motherfucker. Oh, damn. My patience did not fucking show itself there. Oh, but we can't get more stamina because then we can't get the fucking... Damn. Small face. <laughs> so, I can make this bigger. One second. It's funny that you guys are harping on that, of all things. I worked really hard to get this set up. I didn't expect that to be the thing you guys cared about. All right, Link just did some stuff because I threw this controller. But he's a cool guy and a gentleman and a scholar and a scholarman. Whatever the fuck that is. No. Don't you dare do that. Damn computer. Acting like you own the place. We're getting there. I'm like almost there. All right. My face should be bigger to you now. I don't know if that's better or not. I'm sorry you have to see my face. All right. Oh, I do know who that is actually. Let me know if that's better on the camera, by the way. Let's try to make it look better. All right, now we're going to fucking play this Vigi game. Okay, so things I saw in the direct, because there were a bunch, actually, but my mind is escaping me. Um, like I said, the board game thing was really, really fucking cool. I was super into that. That was the future of the future. Um, there were some other games they announced that I was super into that I can't remember exactly what they were. Mario Party. Oh, the Mario Party thing. And being able to, oh my gosh, being able to do local player and like multiplayer at the same time. That's fucking crazy to be like you and your buddy and then your buddy that's like way at home. You All three of you can play at one time. That's fucking insane. No one's ever done that before. To be able to play remote and locally at the same time. That's fucking crazy. That console has so much fucking power if it can do that. There's online service. Yeah, Nintendo's trying to play for that. Oh, that's also the fucking new controllers. They were like, here, we made old NES controllers for all the old NES classics. So you can play them on the NES, but it plays on the Switch. And I was like, what the fuck, Nintendo? Get, just take my goddamn money right now. Dude, if they make a fucking, uh, or sorry, it was a NES controller. If they make a SNES controller, dude, I will fucking buy it. The very fucking second it comes out. I love the SNES controller. That is 100% my favorite controller ever. Especially they make this fucking one that's like a Bluetooth one. With fucking Joy-Con sticks. And it has fucking like fingers on it. Oh my god. And it's Bluetooth. It's fucking crazy. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm done. I'm done talking about my stupid shit that I care about. Alright. Let's fucking let's get going this way, guys. Okay, so, in the midst of this tragedy, I have forgotten to turn up the volume. Echoes don't count. So, what is an Echo? Is it technically just the same character? Like, would you pick Kirby and then be like, the other one? 
It's another other not Kirby, but Kirby. You guys don't count echoes? Like I feel like they kinda count. It's like you can play as that character, so that's that's a character. Dude, fuck you. Such a bullshit. I've gotten to a point with this game that, like, I don't even really worry about health as much. That's why. No, Kirby and King DDD are different. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So, what are you guys most excited about, like, from the Nintendo Direct today? What they talked about? Because that was fucking crazy, dude. And if you haven't watched it, you should go watch it. It's fucking cool. Nintendo knows what the fuck they're doing, dude. I was not convinced for a while, and Dustin convinced me. Because I was like, yeah, they kind of do, but there's all this broken shit. And he's like, mm, just wait. It's going to happen. And they did. They fucking pulled it out, dude. All right, where the fuck are we going to go? Hmm. That looks mountainy. I bet you we haven't been over there. Well, wait, fuck. I know how to tell where we haven't been. Just fucking like uh there. Now we're gonna go get some fucking stuff. The new Smash character? Was there another new Smash character? Cause I don't remember seeing that. Who was it? You gotta tell me, Mike. Mike, I'll die if you don't tell me. I gotta know. <laughs> All right, master mode. Fucking fuck this shit. <laughs> fucking look at my little elephant. My fucking bird. They're like look. It was Isabel. Okay. Is that what the ending thing was? Because I saw the thing for Animal Crossing. Villager. <laughs> I've thought Villager's been in it before. Because I did not know who that character was, like what game that character was from, but I know who he is now. Because of Smash Bros. <sighs> been a long day. Alright, let's go get that fucking tower. And that fucking shrine that's right over next to it. So we're going to the green. Because fucking Breath of the Wild. That guy definitely wants to fight. Do I have any bows? Turn into a ham hawk. Thank you for your ham hawk. Okay. Then the other ones run away because they're scared. They're scared of me. Hey, Fluttershy. If you're still watching, dude, what was your favorite part? of um, uh, the Nintendo Direct. Like, what was the biggest announcement that you were like, oh my god. You can make it, Link. Oh, damn. Alright, where the fuck are we going? Oh yeah, towards the green. God, this is going to take a while. Alright, alright, I see you. I see you over here giving me fucking climbing directions and places and things to do. Up, up. And wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, you didn't have a favorite thing? There wasn't anything that you were like, oh my god, this is going to be the best thing in the universe. This is what Nintendo's all about. Mine's probably the Bluetooth controllers, dude. That or the fucking, like, board game stuff. You mostly like the Mario-related stuff. You're playing Smash Brawl. Smash Brawl's a good game. I have it. Um, I'm garbage at it. I'm absolutely awful at Smash Bros., but I like playing it. I want to do a Smash Bros. tournament for chari charity one day. Um, and I know what charity I want to do it for too, but uh, we just haven't been able to make it happen yet. Alright. 
Here we go, guys. I'm going to get over here on this fucking bullshit arena of chaosness. And then we're going to do great stuff. Alright. So, I want you guys to know that you're the best. And I really want to get this tower and get some other, um, oh, fucking, what are they? Fucking shrines so that we can get some more fucking shrine, whatever, stone thingies. And then we can take the shrine stone thingies and pray to the, the lady of the lake. And the lady of the lake will grant us our ability to pick up a really heavy sword. King Arthur. Because the Legend of Zelda is just King Arthur. Illuminati confirmed. There you go. You're welcome. It's the same game. Story. Here we go. Okay. All right, we're up here. We're going up. Just going to climb this uh, trial. Just, you know, Joseph Campbell the shit out of this. You know, just kind of crawl up this bitch. You know, archetypal models and what's, whatnots and who's what's it's. <laughs> oh. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So we have to get up here, but we can only use our butthole. That's all we're allowed to use. So, you guys figure that one out. Let me know. All right. Can we make it up there? Oh, fuck yeah, we can. I forgot I had this power. Gosh. Dude, get out of here with your communist propaganda fucking goo shit. I don't need that in my life. I got this fucking, this linkage going on. I'm just gonna hop on up here. Get this fucking party going. Dude, they should have a rave on these towers. Rave on the tower. It'd be fucking crazy. It'd be like a fucking like, <gasps> the whole fucking tower's like waving back and forth. It's like being in the Empire State Building on the top floor, fucking having a party. <gasps> Hey, what's up, Dave? Oh, nothing much, Bill. That's Dave from accounting. He's pretty cool. You see Charlene over there? She's a she's a mighty fine one. Great worker. Great worth ethic. She's the one you want to make. Your wife. <laughs> uh, whatever you say, Bill. That's exactly what it would be. Oh, it's in my eye. Oh. Whenever you do what? That's like, <laughs> that's like the anticipation, <laughs> right before you're fucking putting eye drops in. That fucking thing. It's like, buh, 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 buh. you're like, uh, uh, oh god, it hurt my eye. <laughs> Why my eye? Ay ay ay. Oh my gosh, more eye puns. I can't believe it. <laughs> All right. Fucking shit. All right. Mike, tell me a joke. Better be a good joke, though. All right. Fucking shit. All right. We're heading towards. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no. I remember what I'm doing. Okay, we got it. We're fucking. We're finding a shrine. Finding a shrine. Gonna get that shit. Gonna go ahead and give it this big dog. I'm gonna give it the dangle angle on this mountain. Gonna go straight forward and then drop on that rock. Rock, rock, rock. It's a cool rock. That's pretty much it. That's what I got. That you thought I was gonna rap? Fuck that shit. My rap's crap. Yo. It's whack crap. Crap that whacks. Whack my dick. Dick in a shtick. Stick rhymes with dick. Lighter. Lighter than a feather. It's tougher than a board. Border than an ordem. Ordem than an org. The orgs are from Metropolis. Metropolis is cool. Cool is the way to stay in school. 
And though we're running to that stick, the metropolis will always have a big dick. It should have been something to do with the original content to like wrap it all back in together, but I think those were not awful bars done in the in the correct manner. Fucking that'd be good some good slam poetry. Make no fucking sense. And people be like, mm, I get it. <laughs> Me too. Slam poetry. Everybody's like, wow, he really just, he speaks with his words. <laughs> yes, he does. He absolutely does, Damien. <laughs> All right. Hello there, Wolfies. Oh, that's my safe word. Wolfie. Oh, Wolfie. Fuck you. I wonder how many people's safe word that is. I bet there's a statistic for it. How many people have Wolfie as their safe word because they watched The Wolf of Wall Street and got it from that? Bet you it's at least two. Alright. Here we go. Uh, up we go. Where do we stop? Over here. See. All right, so now we're gonna hop in our magic spaceship dick coming from the ground, pimple zit, whatever you wanna call it, puberty hitting motherfucker, highly, 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 and fucking highly, highly, and hilarity rubbing alcohol riots, rally, recto, robin, rotten ramble, reg, rotten ramble egg, rubber, rubber baby bumpers, rubber, rubber, rubber baby bumpers. Something like that. I don't know. It's something. I don't know. Minor test of strength. We are so fucked, guys. All right. Fucking, I want this shit because y'all love the new look, bro. Thanks, bro. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. Can't wait to be back. Yeah, I miss you, dude. Um, I look forward to seeing you, dude. I hope you're having a good time. I hope everything's going good at home. Okay, we're ready. We've got this. What happened to the computer? Just had some problem with it. I'll tell you about it later, man. Alright, so I'm in the heat of battle. Yay, new subscriber, random boy. Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. Alright, so we're in the heat of battle, the heat of the moment. Um, we're going to have to figure out some stuff. Alright, let's, let's get a hearty breakfast in. That's always important. It's a balanced, you know, balanced meal before every battle. That's where I go by, that's my rule of thumb. Um, and of course, I always make sure that, uh, you know, all my items are equipped correctly. And I, Arrow, we can make that work, that's fine, all right. And then we fucking end this guy's fucking life. Get the fuck out of here, you communist piece of shit. Whatever, yeah. So good news, everyone, I didn't take the offer back home, I'm staying, yay. Walters is staying, guys. He was planning on maybe taking another job, and so he might not have uh, been able to stay with us, um, but he's no longer doing that. All right, we're getting him. All right, we need another weapon. Um, let's go ham in the sandwich. All right, fuck you. Come on, come on, come at me. Come at me, brother. Brother Rini. Fluttershy says, hello, CJ. And you know what? I say, yellow, CJ. Yeah, how's it going, bruh? How's it going, dude? All right, we gotta fucking get into battle mode, actually, though. Because we're just kind of dicking with him right now. 
All right, that was close. I'm learning. All right, what are ways we could really fuck with him? That would get his fucking little robot dick going. Fuck with his little robot brain. We could play the game correctly. That would fuck with me. Um, well, yeah, that fucks with me. Can we do anything? Oh, what about... No? No, okay. What if we... Can we do something with that? No. Hmm, have you ever shaved your armpits? Yes, random boy, I have shaved my armpits. Absolute carnage. As we see Link taking an axe to the butt. It's a bad way to die. All right. Okay, I have shaved my armpits. It was when I was trying to get my armpit hair to grow longer because um, I wanted to look more manly, but I was not someone who had a lot of body hair when I was a child. I also did not have a lot of uh, body hair, like now even. You're a girl? That's cool, dude. It happens, I guess. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta live life the way it throws itself at you, you know? So, if that's what I am, it's what I am, bro. Alright, let's fucking kill this piece of shit. Don't care about you. Don't. I'm in a t-shirt, dude. That's how little I care. I should care a little more. Nope. Oh, fuck. You know, I'm not really interested in hearing about your novel anymore. I can't really say that I am. Alright, can we cheese this? It's okay. I can teach you to grow a manly beard. I want a manly beard. What's with the shaving question? I have no clue, dude. He's random boy. He's got to say random stuff, dude. You can't blame him for, you know, doing what he what he put in his name. Like it's not like he lied to us. He told us what he was. You got to not you know, you just got to like learn to not judge so much, you know. What's up, Lean Cuisine? My boy, how are you doing today, buddy? I missed you. My life is a deep hole of emptiness when you're not around. I'm just kidding. Sort of. All right. Well, how how's it going over there, Sonic? Whoa. All right. Shit, I did this again. I cannot do this. Alright, we're gonna do this another time. These fucking tests of strength, it's so much timing involved, and it's like boring to me, because there's not like cool game mechanics that get expanded upon. It's like you learn the fucking thing, and then it's like, okay, mash these buttons in this order. <sighs> you shave your legs for track? So, so yeah. Tired. How are you though? Dude, tired as fuck, man. I just got this computer reset up. That's why the stream was late today. I don't know if I told everybody that, but I basically had to fucking reset up the whole computer. But now it's set up and it's working, so. And it's working pretty well as far as I see. Have you ever shaved the inside of your arse? Well, first off, are you British? <laughs> I must ask. Um, and second off, I've never shaved the inside of my arse, but I've neared it before. Because that shit isn't too bad. And it's all gone at that point. Hello there, what are you? Oh, it's a memory. Dude, we found a memory by accident. I think I've done that like twice. I feel like shaving the inside of your arse would be hard. But I'm sure somebody can do it. Because they're pro. All right, we get it. Yeah, flashback moment. What's gonna happen? You need to wait. All right, there we go. I'm excited for you to come and watch a scary movie with me, Lean Cuisine. We're gonna go and watch a scary movie tomorrow. We're watching The Nun. It's like a double date, but it's just the two of us. All right. Yep, nope, don't care. All right. And then I'm also giving him uh, some some good stuff to work on for the channel that I'm excited about. Yay! All right, here we go. What do we do? What movie, hee <laughs> hee? The Nun. This, the scariest movie that ever existed ever, maybe. Probably not, because most of them aren't good scary movies sad it's only 
two good scary movies, guys. And only one other scary monster that doesn't have a good scary movie. That is actually a scary monster. They're trying, though. Movies are trying, man. Dear Jesus and his brother James. Do you think... Did you see it? Is it going to be scary? Am I going to be terrified? Am I going to be deranged? Am I going to live a life of crime after this? Will Cosmic Brownie ever be able to defeat the Zodiac of... Uh, Clementis. Will he be ever to meet the minor challenge? Can he ever climb this mountain finally? And will the sword be revealed? All this and more on the next sir I'm just kidding, guys. We're not done yet. <sighs> so easy. No, I'm scared. Haha. <laughs> Dude, I am terrified too. I hope it's good though. Because it does sound scary. Like, I haven't seen any kind of like fucking. It's interesting, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, for sure. I'm definitely, oh wait, wow, there's a thing here. But we have to pay for that, and I don't like giving out my money to people who don't just take it and don't try to help anybody else in the world or do anything with their lives. All right, no, I'm scared. The Nun, the Nun, rated R, <laughs> rated Q. I never know why scary movies are really rated R, because they're not scary. I mean, I guess for a kid it is. Depends. I don't know. It depends on the kid. My my sisters both watch scary movies, and I would not as a kid. And I was like, "What the fuck is wrong with y'all?" And I think it's because that's uh, their uh, who their parents were. Like their parents watched scary movies, so therefore they did. But their parents would watch scary movies with them, like show them scary movies. My parents were weird. They were kind of gothic a little bit, at least on my mom's side. It's fucking crazy. All right, here we go. Have I shaved my penis and eyebrows? Slenderman does equal best monster. 100% Slenderman. Go look that shit up. He's fucking crazy. Um, have you shaved your penis or eyebrows? That is a really good question. I have indeed um, shaved like the side of my penis, I guess. But that's not fun at all. And I actually cut it a little bit and so I that's why I nair now because it's not fun you like the class classic monster movie movies I've not watched too many of them honestly it's uh they didn't they never look good honestly most old movies don't look good to me which is really sad because I really enjoy film but I don't enjoy like the older stuff which is sad because those are really good classics Tell Voltage about the videos last night. Oh my gosh, dude. We watched some videos and I was just like, what the fuck is this? Like Jason? Yeah, like Jason, dude. That's definitely a classic. But I think he's talking even older. He's talking like werewolf fucking scary movies and fucking like vampires. Like just generic. Like, beware the vampire. And then that was the fucking movie. Like that's the kind of stuff he's talking about. That shit's crazy, dude. No. Um... Two best scary movies, I'll always say, so far, is The Grudge and fucking It. Prove me wrong. Um, we'll just get the script, see bar here. Uh, Dracula, Wolfman, Frankenstein, yeah. Uh, Nosferatu. I've never watched Nosferatu. Tell him. Tell who? Tell, tell him about the videos? Oh, yeah, they were weird. I, I don't know what to think about them. Uh... But they didn't like break my mind or anything. I wasn't like really impressed with what they did. But it was cool. Yes, the original movie, The Grudge, was based off of and is confirmed to be like 10 times scary. Oh, yeah, I know. And we want to watch it. And I am like so in. Hey, do you know somebody that's watched it, uh, Lean Cuisine? Because if you know somebody that's watched it, then fucking I want to know what their opinion is. Um, all right. Because you said confirmed. So, I want to know if it's actually confirmed scarier. Can confirm scarier than The Grudge. I do know someone that I work with has watched the original and they told me that it was on Netflix at the time. Interesting. Well, I would definitely be interested to watch it. Um, I think that one's going to be a really good one for sure. It's the first movie I've been scared of for a while actually because it like has some kind of air to mystery to it. 
Don't you know Lean Cuisine in real life? Yes, I do. I do know him in real, real life. He's my partner. He does almost all the stuff on the channel that you see all the time. He's works. He works really, really hard. He comes here like every weekend, and he's probably my best friend in the whole world. Yes, I know who he is in real life. All right. And we're jumping. Made it because we're cool. All right. So now we're going to keep going up this for some reason because heights help. Probably best friend in the real world. No, 100% best friend in the real world. 100% best friend in existence. <laughs> when was the last time uh, he's been in a stream? It's been a little bit. Um, he doesn't get to stream with us as much because we're always working on recorded stuff. We He always comes down on the weekends because he lives in Cincinnati. He works really hard, guys. That's what I'm saying. Like, he fucking, like, comes, he drives down here, like, two or three fucking hours sometimes because of traffic to come see my ass so that we can fucking work on this shit. He works so hard, guys. He works harder than I do, 100%. Like, I feel bad for him a lot. Like, I feel like I do a disservice to him with how much shit he does for me. He works my, he works circles around my ass. And he's a lot smarter, too, actually. All right, here we go. We're going up this fucking rock. Because it's a rock. And then we're going to fucking go up this rock. Because that is also a rock. Okay. All right. Go, go Colin. Go Cosmic. It's your birthday. I should have just went with the first one. We're going to party like it's your birthday. We're going to party like it's your birthday. Because we don't give a fuck. It's your birthday. All right. Where the fuck do we go now? Um, I'm looking for shrines, guys. Are we at the edge of the map? Nice. We made it to the edge of the map. Fuck that. I pick a red. Nope. Fuck that, too. Danger zone. Danger zone. Equip. Fucking do I have anything? Nothing too good. All right. Well, fuck that. Highway to the danger zone. This is my fuck this I'm getting out button. Highway to the danger zone. He fucking flies out with fucking sunglasses on like a badass. <laughs> <laughs> can you do the toad voice i have tried um i can try again i would love to um because like i said i like doing voice acting um hello i'm toad nice to meet you toad good to see you toad wow what are you doing toad that's kind of that's what i got <laughs> i don't know if that's good or not it's really hard on my voice, though, but I like it. It's fun to do. Uh, another one that I really like to do that I, uh, Dustin told me I was good at. If somebody tells me I'm good at a voice, then I automatically note that in my head because I'm like, okay, I should remember that I can do a good a person of this. Best toad voice. No, man. Aaron's pretty damn good, dude. Sup, Mark? What's up, my dude? <laughs> um, no, Lean Cuisine told me I had a good... Uh, that isn't his voice? Oh my gosh, what is his voice now? Because his voice used to be that. It was this gravelly old fucking like, you're like, what the fuck is this? Um, are you talking about his voice from fucking uh, Mario Party 2? Because that one's way different. Toadsworth? I don't even know who Toadsworth is. Dude, you're getting into some deep fucking lore. I do not know who that is. We're in the fucking snow. Yes, I love the snow. Anyway, I can do a good Professor Oak voice because uh, Dustin told me I could, and I believe Dustin. Though I kind of tried to steal his thunder once on an episode of Pokemon that we recorded that I probably shouldn't have said that because we weren't supposed to tell people that we did Pokemon. You son of a... 
Mark says, okay. What are we what are we okaying, Mark? The development of mankind? Ah shit. Okay, that was scary. He was a little spooky up here. It's a little spooky in this area. Let's see if we can do something about No, they're white. Fuck that. Those guys are strong. The white ones are really, really strong in this game. Alright. So, can you ask what I should play next? Hey guys, what game would you guys like to see Voltage play next? Because he's supposed to be doing some stuff next week whenever he comes back. Oops. The brown toad with the mustache. He was in Mario Sunshine. Oh. I'm concerned with the well-being of the princess. <laughs> hmm. Mario, go over there and find us some shade. <laughs> Is that what you're wanting? Because I love him. I didn't know that's what his name was. Dead by Daylight. Oh, okay, yeah. Voltage, they want to see Dead by Daylight. Um, and other titles. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go, guys. We're gonna rock and roll this shit. Non-stop and all this shit. Drop and pop and lock and rock and all this shit. Hey guys, I'm going to play Mega Man 11, by the way. I like it a lot, so I want to play it. So I just wanted to throw that out there. You guys got me into Mega Man 11. You can always say that the fans are the ones that got me into Mega Man, because I never played it before you guys. You guys popped that cherry. Voltage should play Peter Griffin Adventures. Play Peter Griffin Adventures. They say that's a good one. Should I still play that game or no? If he's going to play it, do you want me to play it, or do you want me to not play it? Because... I have no clue. I'm just going to take your shit, and then I'm going to leave, guys. So don't worry about it. Have a good day. No, it's cool. I'm, I'm certified. C certifiable. It's crazy. Uh, also, I'm going to be playing God of War 3 Remastered. Oh, shit. Remastered, motherfuckers. Fucking. I just play the originals and stuff. The only way I play something new is if... Oh, no, I need this... Oh, Good gourmet meat. Uh, play something like like an older game in a newer version as if it's just more convenient to play. Um, but I like playing the old consoles. I love getting out the old consoles and playing them. I wish we could play them more, but most people don't like watching them. If we could find good stuff from the old consoles that people would like to watch, I would definitely do it. Um, but, you know, such is life. La Vida Loca. Alright, so we're going up. We're gonna hop, hop, hibbity, ba, hip, hip, hop, dip, ba, hip, dip, ba, hop, do, don't stop. With the bang, bang, boogie, wop, wop, ba, doogie, and the something in the bubble, the ba. And then a zap, zap, zoo, bop, boop, ba, gaba, dee, bop, ba, do, ba, dee, ba, dee, ba, da, ba, dee, ba. I always feel like a mixture between, whenever I, I, I scat, I feel like a mixture between Jack Black and, uh, uh, fucking Louis Armstrong. Some kind of that. Uh, Peter Griffin plus the Lord of Savior. Oh my gosh. I need to play it. Barry B. Benson, Shaggy, and Carl. Best Friends Dance Adventure Deluxe Video Game. Uh, play that voltage. Gosh. I can't wait to do the Peter Griffin adventure. That's going to be fun. I'll have to do that. Is it a Steam game? Like, where do I find this game so that I can make sure I can get it? Oh, man, this is a big mountain. We're in dangerous territory now, Will Robinson. All right, fuck that. I hope you press the, that notification bell button. We can do that for you if that will make you happy. I just got to run while I do it. And it says new subscribers. Random boy. What? I'm confused. Shaggy and Carl are best friends. They seem like the type that would get along really well, actually. Scooby would be jealous, though. It's like when Turk and Dr. Cox started doing things together. He was jealous, dude. 
upset for him though. Jealousy is not becoming. Whoa, is this more people I could steal from or is this the same people I already stole from? Because that would definitely decide whether it'd be a good idea to go there or not. Man, you can get lost in this game for sure. Get fucking like absorbed. At least they have good dance moves. Oh yeah, definitely. For sure. At first I thought it said at least they have good dance nudes. And I was like, I didn't need to know that. But thank you for sharing and giving me your knowledge. Teaching me the ways of the world. The ways of Sakuga. Because that's a thing now, Sakuga. I just learned that recently, that word, Sakuga. It's an interesting word. Interesting little ditty. Little ditty, ditty, ditty. Take a little bit that sounds more Victor Wooten. Shit, we're fucked. We're all dead. We're fucked. We're fucked to death. We're fucked to death. And death. Absolute drowning death and of destruction and nothing. Welcome to the nothingness that exists in my heart. Alright. Fuck you. You're gonna be a steak. I should start doing army cadences more. I know a bunch of them actually. I, they're super programmed into my brain from where we like would run and do cadences. I hear the choppers hovering. They're hovering overhead. They come to get the wounded. They come to get the dead. Airborne. A rangers lead the way. Oh. That was stuff we fucking like sang every day, dude. It was so fucking like shoved into your brain. You never forget those, ever. Cadences are fucking crazy, dude. There's some funny ones, though. There's some fucked up ones, too. There's, like, Club and the Baby Seals. That's pretty fucked up. Club and the Baby Seals. They don't let them do that one anymore. Because people were not happy about that one. Which is good. I'm glad they got rid of it. Um... Have you seen this show, The Shoe? People, it's actually really terrifying. I've never heard of it. The Shoe People? That's a totally new one on me. Oh, I see. Well, so uh, we're just going to talk about our day because I'm wait. Oh, nope, we're good. We're good. I don't want to talk to you guys. I'm just kidding. I love you. I want to talk to you all the time. Tell me more about your lives. Um... Anyway, that was a wipeout if you didn't know. Bump, bump, bump. Bump, bump. Bump, bump, drum break. Bump, bump, tick, 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 bump, bump, tick, 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 bump, tick, 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 bump, 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 really fast to wipe out you know i could do like 40 fucking minutes of fucking it's a lot like the the william tell overture thing gets in your brain <laughs>
Now that you're an employee of the Krusty Krab, it's time to learn the secret formula. Whoa, it's secret formula. Whoa, it's cool. How did we end up back over here? Holy shit. I'm going in circles, guys. I'm going in fucking circles. All right. Fucking fuck this shit. We're going here, and we're heading towards the fucking forest what we're doing I think that's where the forest is if I'm wrong please correct me because I don't need to be wrong on this one <laughs> all right let's fucking go fist pound me bro throw money like dough So hard, felt like I stubbed my toe. Yo. All right. So now we're here. We're doing this. We're doing great. We're doing things. We're living life. We're living like Larry, um, living La Vida Loca, whichever of those sayings that you'd like to, you know, pull out that makes you feel like your life is important because it super is and you need to remember that so you need to carry that inspiration with you and take it with you to the grave because you are going to do such great things along your journey and remember to enjoy that journey because you know it's really difficult sometimes when you're in the hard parts and in that pain period of your life but you're going to get out of it one day and you're going to be on the other end and that other end is going to help so just keep working guys don't worry what anyone else says, because you know what? If you really want to do it, you can do it. It's my ninja way. Believe it. All right. Fucking shit. Okay, 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 okay. I don't think we're anywhere close to where I want to be. I forget how big this map is. Okay. Isn't it like right over here somewhere? I feel like that's gonna be a shitty place to drop. Lonaroo Wetlands. It's gotta be like right here, right? I think so. Do you have any amiibos or did Voltage check shove them up his ass? I don't know what a check shove is. But, we do not have any amiibo. Well, we have one, technically. We have, it's Lean Cuisine's amiibo, not mine. But it's here. I keep meaning to do the amiibo rant with it and fucking keep working on that. But, I'm trash. Because I said I was going to make a rant about amiibos. And you guys were excited about it. And then I didn't do it. And I'm sorry. And I'm still working on it. But, it's just a lot of projects, you know. But if you really want that project, let me know. We'll make it happen. All right. Here we go. Which one is it? It is Ike from Smash Bros. Yeah. I would love to have the Shovel Knight one. It looks cool. Plus, Game Grumps talked about it, and that got me a little hard. And plus, Dustin told me about the Shovel Knight game and... You know, that got me a little hard. But I still haven't watched it because I want to play it with Dustin. That's one of the games I wanted to save um, to play with him specifically first on the channel. Because I didn't want um, I didn't want to ruin the experience if he and I do it together for the first time. Then it's like he gets to show me the game, which I know he likes doing. He loves showing me games. And I love receiving his knowledge because he is very knowledgeable about games. The motherfucker listens to books on tape about video games. Like textbooks, not fucking like good books. Listens to textbooks. Alright. He's a nerd for sure, trust me. 
probably more nerdy than I am in some ways. But in other ways, he's like fucking James Dean, like the coolest motherfucker you'll ever meet in the world. I just want somebody to make a compilation video of all the things I say about Dustin. I just want to see. I think it'd be funny. That'd be a funny one for the future. One day. Oh. Uh, I just don't have the time to do it myself. I gotta make an amiibo rant first. Alright. I'm pretty sure it's like this way, right? I don't know. We're, we're making this up a lot as we go, guys. Just so you know. It's all improv. That's, that's what this game is. You just make it up as you go. Pick things to do. Pick some apples. Maybe, you know, do a dive roll. Maybe, you know, sled down a shield and make yourself look dumb. Like a pot lid shield person who does things that, how do I do this? Why are you not shield sliding? I don't remember how to shield slide, guys. It's been a while. I've alerted the enemy. I should take cover. I need to run. Oh my goodness. Yep, they're keys. It's not that big of a deal. We can murder all of them. Let's sakuga. Doom. Did that get rid of some? Yes, it did. Did that? Nope, nope. They weren't happy about that. They That wasn't enough bloodshed for them to finally feel that they had, you know, been taught their lesson. Have you been taught your lesson now? Good. Leave. Leave us. We will decide our own fates. Something's hitting me in the water. Oh, these guys are the worst. X to dash. X to dash. You can make it. X to dash. X to dash! Yeah, you did it, dude. Dude, my man did it. That was a terrifying event that just happened in my life, and I'm sorry that it wasn't something that I could it's the end, and here we go. Rand boy, tell me a random fact about yourself. And the random fact that I want to hear is, what do you tell people that is a random fact about you whenever you, uh first start a class that's what I want to hear when someone's like yo tell us one random thing about you that's cool or something like that and you're like it's not cool and you're like no no it's cool it's cool everybody's like and you're, and you're too cool for for being cool so you're like nah man it's just normal it's just it's whatever you know you're just trying to play it off and everything because random boy's that guy he's the cool guy and he's like no nah, no nah, it's cool bro like uh it's no problem I, I just uh you know I was just wondering you know and then you ask, and so my thing is that I, I can do, I can burp the alphabet backwards. You as a volunteer firefighter, is that your normal one that you go with? Voltage? That's like, you're, you're like, when people ask, like, what did you do? You're like, I'm a volunteer firefighter, man. Mine was um, being in the army for a long time, and it was being, it was playing saxophone for a long time. I think we picked the thing that most identifies us. And now it'd probably be like, I'm the crazy YouTube guy. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you're boring. I don't think you're boring. I had a a a, a grand boyfriend thing. I don't know how to say this. It was my grandmother's uh, boyfriend. You're gonna think it's my boyfriend who was a grandmother but it's not the case um it was he it was my grandmother's boyfriend at the time yes that was weird but you know it was whatever and he was a volunteer firefighter man and he was interesting it's a weird guy though it's either that or i got discharged out of the marines during boot camp idk yeah i feel that Saying the volunteer firefighter thing probably gets you a better rep, truthfully. Because people like look down on people that don't make it through boot camp. And I don't think that that is fair. Because truthfully, like boot camp's hard. You have to actually, like, you have to, like, it's mentally really hard. You have to convince yourself that you want to do it enough. And that's hard to get that motivated. Another stone talus? That could be an adventure. But we're trying to get to the uh, other place. And he looks like he's having a good day. We won't fuck it up for him. Alright, does anyone know 
where the Lost Woods actually is. And would you like to help me? Or that in college I passed out half in and half out the dorm room because I drank a lot. I don't remember that. I do not remember that at all. So the fire fire story, story or the fail story. I think both of those are great stories. But I think, um, so I think that if you tell the firefighter story, it tells you that you're like a really nice person and you're, you know, very willing to like work on uh, things for other people. Um, and then you said, so uh, the fail story, it makes you look bold. It makes you seem like, okay, like this is who I am and I'm just not going to apologize for it because that's what I'm about, guys. So, I mean, it's really like whatever you feel like you want to seem like to people I was at drill drill does mi make me miss a lot of things all right We're gonna try and fucking fly up this shit. Oh my god. Oh, the sun just came out. And you know what? The sun will come out tomorrow because that'll be the next time that we see old Cosmic Brownie. So, uh, thank you so much, guys, for coming and hanging out with me. Um, as always, I really, really appreciate you guys. Um, you really brighten my day up. Um, probably more than you guys ever, ever will know. Um, I genuinely feel like we have built a community and a family, and I want uh, everyone to be a part of that family and feel included. Um, and... Um, I just, I, I need to go to bed, honestly. Um, I have to get up in the morning for work, and work is really, really early, so that's the biggest reason. I know this was short. It was short mainly because I had to cut it early because I was working on um, uh, fixing the computer. But now that the computer's fixed, tomorrow I'll give you a way better stream. It'll be a longer stream. We'll actually get into it. We're going to play another game, maybe play this game if you want, but trust me. It's going to go good. So, I promise you guys we will be back tomorrow. We just were having technical difficulties. It's a hard week. It's been a hard week at work. It's been a hard week everywhere. So, if you're having a hard week, don't feel bad. Like, if you're feeling like you're failing at everything in life, I have failed at everything in life this week. Everything I've tried to do when I was working, when I was at home. Um, I even went to try and cash my check at the bank today. And they were like, you can't do that. We have to do it this way. And so, I can't even, like, get that money till tomorrow. So, trust me, guys. Like I know what you guys are, are thinking, and I'm sorry. I'm I'm trying to be as dedicated to this as possible, um, but I couldn't do it without this computer. So now that the computer is fixed, I will be back tomorrow with a long stream for you guys because you guys are the greatest fans that I have ever seen anybody have. Seriously, I have the best fans ever. So I will be back. I promise, and we will do a longer stream tomorrow. We'll do something fun. If you guys want to, go ahead and throw something in the chat or on the Discord or comment on a video and tell me what you want to see me play tomorrow. Um, and we'll, we'll look into it. We'll see if we can make it happen. Um, so, Corey Jackson, yo, dude, we're actually just wrapping up. Um, thank you for coming by, though. And if you would like to check out another one of our videos sometime, don't forget to subscribe, man. Just give us a subscription and, you know, next stream tomorrow at 6.30 try and give us a, a chance you know can you play five nights at freddy's sure dude um i want to see what everybody votes but yes i would be down to do that so so far we're doing five nights at freddy's tomorrow um but we'll see so thank you Corey jackson we appreciate it dude and you'll get to see us tomorrow for this stuff so as always guys keep it real keep it cool and as always keep it fresh guys um and have a good one you guys have a good 
Friday and a great weekend. And let's move into this next week ready to take over and accomplish.